Cross, with the dethroned princes pledged to fight for their rights, was born what is historically known as the League of the Lotus. Secret meetings were held all over the country, and an insidious incitement to revolt rippled under the surface for four long years. Religious instincts were inflamed by stories circulating among troops under British command that the newly introduced greased cartridges they had to bite before firing were smeared with the blood of the cow and the fat of the pig. Such measures were more than effective. The clamor for revolt grew, plans were laid, the people waited for the fatal date. In faraway Jhansi, the Rane cautioned against any hasty action that might jeopardize success. But nine weeks early, there occurred an incident that was to change the course of history. In a small cafe, a dancing girl entertained a group of sepoys. Among them was a young hothead named Mangal Pande, with whom she was in love. She mocked him for wearing the hated greased cartridges. Whereupon, in a moment of frenzied excitement, he loaded his rifle with one of the hated cartridges and fired, killing his commanding officer. Mangal Pande was executed, the soldiers disarmed, and the spark ignited that was to set all India aflame.